haters and the violence, the harassment, the insulting. The people wanted to to treat me like uh, uh, to rape me or to uh, they were anti-Semitic, lesbophobic, fatphobic. If you know Matteo Salvini, yes. an Italian minister, I mean, he said that your beat on the ceremony was a, an insult to millions of Christians. Yeah, I can reply to him that uh, he, doesn't, he doesn't have power in France and he doesn't have power on me. So I don't care. After the ceremony, what yeah, happened? Yeah, I received a lot of uh, stories and messages and I shared it. No, it was really emotional because I, I was so happy to be in this uh, tableau because it was friends, you know, and it was uh, my friends, it was the friends uh, that I wanted. Like, I thought about me as a kid or as a young lesbian. And I was like, wow, if I, if I was young now and, I, uh, and if I watched this when I was young, um, it will uh, empower me so much. And uh, but after like the side effect uh, with the, all the haters and the violence, the harassment, the insulting, the people wanted to to treat me uh, like uh, uh, to rape me or to uh, who they were anti-Semitic, lesbophobic, fatphobic. You know, it was uh, really hard because I I, uh, I was not expecting this. Right now, I'm fine. I'm on vacation. I'm in, with my wife. So I'm happy to be there. What was the message that you wanted to communicate in the segments of the opening ceremony of the Olympics? Alors, my, my, uh, it's not my message, it's the message of, uh, you know, all the core team of the, yes. of the ceremony. I'm just an interpret. Uh, I just uh, did the music for my part and I just was there in the center of the table the message in general, it's, uh, it's really, it's representing France, it's pre uh, representing art, uh, parties, dance, everybody has a place, a place to be in France. So that was the message to, to represent diversity uh, uh, in front of the world. I start preparing my uh, DJ set uh, around uh, April or March. The first part, it was a catwalk with uh, representing all the fashion designer, the young fashion designer in France. And at the end, it was really the feast of Dionysos and uh, Dionysos was uh, Philippe Catherine. A lot of people instead said that it was the reenactment of the Last Supper. In art, everybody can see what they want. And also, I think it's just an excuse to say that they are not agree to watch uh, LGBTQ people or uh, fat people in a stage in front of the world. That's their excuse to be fatphobic, homophobic, transphobic, and uh, racist. 80, uh, 86 percent of the population uh, uh, say that it was the best ceremony ever. But uh, you know, the minority uh, of the haters always speak too loud. It's uh, important to mute them. So now, my work. Uh, start now. It's uh, to really, uh, I really want uh, justice and uh, I want uh, them to feel uncomfortable to spread hate. Not just me, but uh, you know, I'm thinking about uh, like uh, social media with kids. I am strong, but uh, you know, there are many young uh, people who, who not stronger as me. And uh, with all this aid, it's really easy to commit suicide. So I'm fighting for all the people uh, who cannot speak anymore now. Have you read the story of Iman Khalif? Iman Khalif? Yeah. Do you think that people who criticize you and people who uh, criticize her share the same platform? Almost the same, but uh, they are racist and also misogynistic. She's uh, Iman with a really strong girl and uh, she has the right to be there that uh, we are here we resist and uh, and we will fight and we are proud to be what we are we are all behind her and she has to be pr proud of her because we are if you know matteo salvini yes I, uh, an italian minister i mean he said that your beat on the ceremony was a uh, an insult to millions of christians yeah i can reply to him that uh, 
he can take uh, care of uh, his politic uh, inside his country, but not in all. Yeah. It was France, but he, he doesn't he doesn't have power in France, and he doesn't have power on me. So I don't care. Open your mind, open your ears, come to my dance floor, and you will discover what is it to be together and what is it to feel love.